another uh, PG3 statement is our city has budgeted steady increases in all departments except roads. We just heard from Dean uh, Mark and about about that statement. So this is another one of their graphs, and we were confused about this one too. And here's why: None of us were on the council previous to 2012. For some reason, the PG3 has chosen to go back 10 years, and we have no idea why, because none of us were in office. I took office right here in January 2012, and since I took office, the road budget has increased, according to their own graph. This is the PG3 graph. <coughs> we don't know why, unless it's just to confuse people, why they're going back to look at a track record that, although it's relevant to the city as a whole, is actually irrelevant to the candidates running for city council. Eric did not take office until April 2015 of this year. Like I said, I was 2012, and when that happened, we've seen that steady increase in the road budget, as we said. Yet according to PG3, not one penny has been increased towards roads. That's actually a statement from, their, from a video on their website. Um, Lynn has, hasn't served on the city council, so he's never had a vote, but uh, we're not sure why, why the 10 years, why, why they're going back that far. It's to blame me for 2007. <laughs> <laughs> Why'd you do that? <laughs> I would do it again. That's for sure. We're much better off, and you know, we, we appreciate our, our full time fire fire department and, and the choices that were made regarding that. But we think this is relevant because, and I know it's relevant, if you're going to look at a candidate and look at their track record, then let's be accurate what we're looking at. Not the years before any of us took office but the current time that we have been on with, and, and as you can see, we have made efforts to increase the road budget. This is, according to the PG3, we're on an unsustainable trend, and before our council, and even if it, it were to continue, this is their unsustainable trend. You'd see that the road money would be decreasing. Luckily, our council decided in 20, about 2012-2013 that we were going to start increasing our road funds based on citizen feedback. And now we're looking at, at that trend. This is a million dollar difference between the two from the previous, um, the, the previous period to now. Million dollar difference. So to say we haven't put a penny towards roads is incorrect. 